feet actually going to get on? <laughs> He's sitting on the camera. There's a bee on you guys. Just be really still. <laughs> so okay. Weird. He flew away. You're good. <laughs> oh my gosh. Well. Hi, welcome to the house of Valentina. I'm Valentina and my husband Jack is hanging out with us today because we have made over our front door and oh my gosh. It looks amazing. It does, doesn't it? Looks it looks so good. <laughs> so good. Yes. This entire project started because the other day we simply asked this question to each other, like, how should we decorate for fall? Next thing I know, the entire porch is taken apart <laughs> and there's all kinds of new stuff coming in. I'm thinking like, let's add a little spider or some <laughs> spider webs. The next thing I know, there's paint flying everywhere and like plants showing up. So you you turned something and we were wrestling with it and you turned something that I, honestly, I think neither one of us have been happy with for a few years. Yeah. And you made like a centerpiece to this front door and yeah. it looks awesome. I think before it was just a little bit dingy feeling. It just didn't have a whole lot of life to it. So we are gonna back up just a few days because we've got so much to share with you. We wanna share the whole process with you. So make sure you subscribe and then hit the little bell so that when we post these new videos, you know they're coming. <laughs> Absolutely. Let's back up a few days and jump right in. Is this where the backup goes? What's that? Like in the movies, it always goes like wavy, like woo, back in time. <laughs> Is that what that was? Yeah, back in time. I thought you were having a stroke. Yeah, <laughs> back in time. Wait just a minute, I'm gonna take a picture of the front. I don't wanna forget what it looks like. I'm like kinda of notorious for that. <laughs> I think we'll be fine though. I don't want a lot of stuff up here. I don't want it to be super busy. I don't know what we're gonna do. Let's go see what we find. We're heading to one of our favorite places and the drive is absolutely the best part of this entire thing. So we're going to show you a little bit of the drive and then I think the parking lot, is, I don't know. I don't know if we're going to be able to get in or not because I think it's going to be really full. But in the meantime, let's check out the amazing, amazing drive to get out here. When we wake, hear the birds and see the sun. Side by side, our fears are done. All the good times just begun. Yeah, it's cool. I love these. So modern. Mm hmm. They have some texture. Don't you think something like this is prettier than a big ball of mums? Mm hmm. You but got then it's like too busy. We've got the containers. Yeah, I know. That's just too busy, too. Let me take this off for a second. No yeah. one's around. So what we're struggling with is that our house isn't super modern on the exterior, but we like a really modern style. So we're trying to find ways to infuse those styles so that they still look good. And certain plants, a lot of times a larger leaf or a certain shape will feel more modern, especially in the right kind of container. But at the same time, I don't know, like, we have limitations because the, the porch itself isn't huge. So we really don't, it's actually quite small up there. So we're trying to figure out what we're gonna do and what's gonna look good when you drive up and then what what looks good when you're standing on the porch as well. We know what we have, let's hold on tight. Found what we're looking for in life. Call us crazy, but things are finally right. All right, we are back in the car because they did not have any white pumpkins. They had like three really, really, really big ones. So those white pumpkins are very um, in around this area because we have a lot of farmhouses. So I would imagine that those went really fast. So we're going to go to Pike's and Home Depot and see what yeah. we can find. See if in the general mass public we can find some. Yeah, so let's go. Well, we've had absolutely no luck. You want orange? We're good in the area, but if you want white, forget it. So we're gonna have to head to Home Depot and see if we can find something there. Let's or go. I can just be like this guy and carry all those pumpkins for twenty-four dollars. All you can carry. All you can carry. Pumpkin challenge. Except they're all orange. I swear his arms don't look attached. All right, let's go. <laughs> Buddy wants white pumpkins this year. Mums. So I don't know what we're gonna do. 
but we're not going to be buying white pumpkins. I can tell you that. Apparently not. <laughs> Apparently I'm not the only one that just wants some Christmas this year. <laughs> Wonders of life got the pretty. Look what we found at Whole Foods. <laughs> Yay. Yay. Finally. I know. They're a little, still a little small, but I think it's going to be all right. And now we get to find my favorite pretzels. We may have quite possibly polished off a pretty good amount of the uh, pretzels out of this bag. Mm. Pretzels are a healthy snack, though, so it's. <laughs> now, Mara, I'm going to It's better than the MM cookies sitting at home waiting for me. The car is pretty loaded up back there. Mm -hmm. We've got the lanterns and camera and candles and pumpkins and yeah, all kinds of stuff happening back there. But uh, I think it's been really fun. I'm ready to get it all set up and hoping that it will actually look really cute. So, anyways, are you ready to go home? I'm ready to go home. Yeah, me too. I'm tired. I need a coffee. <laughs> Coffee yeah. is calling. We know what we have. Let's hold on tight. Found what we're looking for in life. Oh, God, I hate to do this. I hate to do this. I'm so sorry, Mr. Plant. But I gotta get you off this house. We'll move you to the back. What you doing there? <laughs> I'm shopping for outdoor chairs. <laughs> in the car. In the driveway. Because I was out here keeping you company while you swept the porch. <laughs> All we've done is open a big old can of worms. That's what we'll call it. Oh! <laughs> this is so pretty. Isn't it beautiful? I love it. Well, we need to make sure the pumpkins aren't in the way so we can get to this. Oh my gosh. Life lesson 1021, do not paint your exterior door in a matte paint. It does not work. <laughs> oh, it gets dirty really easy bad, doesn't it? It just, it it shows just blemishes. literally does it just not looks work. flat, yeah. Yeah, it doesn't work. So you're going to go shiny or whatever it's called? They have like an exterior paint that you put on it. Okay. It's called so. shiny. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We'll let you go get the paint. I want some shiny black paint. <sighs> No, that looks. This looks a thousand times better. This looks much more like us. Yes, but you have to help me get the rest of these cobwebs. I yeah. will. I got a lot of cleaning up there to do. Yeah, we do. There's like some baby booties. So cute. All right. I think that's it for today. All right. I'm pretty sure my hair is all messy. Oh, you look hot. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Said no one ever. Besides Whatever. my Jack. <laughs> That's Aww, fine. <laughs> your Jack loves you. Oh, love you too, baby. <laughs> hey, somebody's got their paint clothes on. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> yes, I do have my paint clothes on and a paintbrush in hand. So you know what that what means. Is, something's getting painted. <laughs> something's getting painted in this house. Can you guys guess what that thing is going to be? Okay, I'm probably going to surprise you. No, I'm not painting my bedroom yet. Painting the fireplace? Are you going back with I'm not painting pink? the fireplace ever. <laughs> <laughs> I am, however, standing here with the deck opened to all the black colors, and that is because I am painting the front door. Shut the front door. <laughs> so I've been picking colors, and um, maybe I'll take you guys outside. Let me show you what I'm thinking. I don't even remember what color this was originally. I could go down in the basement and dig through the 5,000 samples that I have sitting down there, but I can't be bothered. So um, instead, um, I think that I'm gonna go with Nightfall because I like the color of this. This is the original paint that I don't have to go through the HOA on. I'm really just using the same color again. Um, I really liked this one, but it's called Cheating Heart. And I just can't put Cheating Heart on my door. That's just wrong. The one I wanted to use, just because of what they named it, was French Beret. But I was afraid that maybe it was a little too... I thought French navy. Berets were red. No, they're black. They are on the vacation movies. What? Which is how I learned about European culture. So instead, I went with Nightfall. I'm about to send Jack to the store. <laughs> Thank you. Really? Even that bird didn't like it. <laughs> 
Where it's like, nah. Oh my god. Nah. <laughs> Why are you sending your husband? <laughs> he has. <laughs> <laughs> I love that bird. Oh my bird. gosh. Well, anyways, I'm going to send this man to go get me some paint and bring it home. And then I'm the one that has to do all the work. In the meantime, I'm going to wipe all this down. I'm going to paint all of this. Okay, and the reason why is because once you paint all of this one color, oh, it's gonna be such a job. <laughs> okay, so once you paint all of this, it's gonna make the door look bigger and it's gonna give it more of a focal point instead of just this puny little door on the big front of the house that doesn't really draw your eye. So it's an inexpensive trick when you don't have expensive doors. You need to go get me some paint. Yes. And I'm going to make a coffee in the meantime. By the way, you are the hottest painter I have ever seen. <laughs> oh, God. Don't show my toes. They are matte black. <laughs> they are. They match your door. Oh, my God. I would hire you to paint. I'd have new projects every week if you were my painter. <laughs> I am your painter. What are you talking about? I feel like a... this thing which isn't a fun job but someone's got to do it and I'm gonna be the one so let's get this thing uh, start at the top <laughs> and work our way down when we wake hear the birds and see the sun while I was up here I noticed how utterly filthy this lantern is it is so gross so gross there's like some sort of fossilized nest on it. I want to replace it so bad. And I've been shopping for them, but I just can't buy one that I love just yet. So I'd rather leave this one for now and shop a little bit more and find one that I really love than rush it just so we can have a little makeover for today. Um, so instead I'm going to keep scrubbing. You can see just how much dirt and grime is on this thing. It's really bad. We don't need no more. Yeah. The paint color does not look as dark once I opened it as it did on the card. I've used Nightfall before, but I'm not sure it's dark enough. But I'm gonna go ahead and get started with the first coat on the door because that's easy to fix if it's not the right color. Let's see. I've used this color before. That's definitely not. I know that when usually, see this is what I tell people all the time, is when you're doing it exterior, you're gonna have a lot of sun on it. So anything that you use that's got a creamy color will actually look more white. There's a little bit on the can. What does it look like? What are you guys doing? Painting the front door? Please don't spill that. I mean, it looks like it's closer to the, it looks like it's that. It's just the light, the amount of light hitting it. Well, I don't like it at all. I definitely want it to be darker. Attempt number two is looking darker already in this little pan here. So let's see how we did. This is Black by Benjamin Moore. So this should do it. Ah, there we go. Much better, much, much, much better. As you can see, we've been pulling all the pieces together over the last few days. We've painted this amazing black door. I love it so much. And now it's time to put the finishing touches on it. I've got a few amazing things that we've collected over the last few days. and I'll show you as I put them up. Number one are these amazing lanterns from Pottery Barn. These are incredible and humongous and I've put a real candle inside of it. I know you can do the flameless if you don't want the real ones, but I'm so excited about lighting these little babies up and having real candlelight on the porch. Next up, we've got this really cute, there's no place like home doormat. I just love it. 
And ha, ha, we got the white pumpkins. Yes. Oh my goodness. Can you guys get over this amazing white berry wreath? I found this at Crate and Barrel and I had to have it. It's just one of those things. You just see something that you love so much and you just know you're gonna use it for a really long time. I wanted something that would really pop on this amazing black color. I mean, can you guys get over this paint? I can't. I'm so excited, I could just about hyperventilate. <laughs> I'll try to keep it together. <laughs> I think my hair is in the wreath. <laughs> All right, let me give you a full tour of this space. I love the way the sun just dapples through here and I'm gonna light the candles and I'm gonna make my pumpkin spice latte and I'm hoping that my husband will get home in a few minutes and we can sit together and enjoy all of our hard work. Before this space was a little bit tired, it didn't have a whole lot of personality, and I really had kind of neglected it, to be perfectly honest, that with just a couple days and a little bit of elbow grease, this whole space is completely transformed. <laughs> enjoy today's video we sure have had fun pulling it together it's been a lot of fun this is a totally different way of filming for us and I hope you guys liked it like let us know down below in the comments if you like love this different type of style yes if you like to go on little field trips with us and take the camera with us and actually see what we're we're up to in between those moments when all the things get put in and everything is happening you know in the in the moment at the house so i hope that you have enjoyed it don't forget to give it a thumbs up don't forget to hit subscribe if you haven't already and if you love even more behind the scenes action and things that are going on before in between the videos go over to instagram you can follow us there just i love this i love that we get to hang out here and now we have the rest of the porch to do so this was the front door which led to other things as every project does. <laughs> well, thank you guys so much for joining us. We hope that you enjoyed it. We hope we'll get to see you in the next one. And until then, cheers. Cheers. <laughs> Are you gonna drink it this time? I am. <laughs> <laughs> Bye guys. Bye. You don't want me to stare awkwardly at them again? Cheers. They all really enjoyed that part. Stop. <laughs> a typical man, if a joke works once, do it you over You keep and over. doing it. I've been telling some of these jokes since I met ya. Oh really? It landed me the chick. It keeps her around. I'm sure that's what it was. When we wake, hear the birds and see the sun. It was the one about where you leave a dog with no legs? Yeah, do you guys know that one? Where do you leave a dog with no legs? Right where you left them. It really is. I'm available for hire. I can travel. <laughs> can spice latte? Oh. Don't say the word. Puppercino. <laughs> oh, you love those, don't you? You like going to Starbucks? <laughs> yeah, you love Starbucks? <laughs> Haley may take him quite regularly. He sees the green sign, he knows exactly what he's getting. He knows when he's in the car going to Starbucks. Star